I expected the James Bond theme song to kick off while I was watching the heir apparent Largo Winch because it was that exciting. When a billionaire industrialist dies, an heir that no one knew about not only must take over his company, but must find his father's killer. This is an action-packed, different kind of spy movie that delivers a lot for one good time. Nario Winch is one of the most wealthy men on the planet and the majority shareholder for the W Group. When he is murdered, the company is thrown into turmoil, but then it's discovered he had an adopted son that nobody ever heard of. Largo is estranged from his father, but news of his death brings him back to Hong Kong, away from his adventurous lifestyle. Not only does he have to keep the company from falling into the hands of a criminal, but he has to use all of the skills that he's learned over the years to bring his father's killers to justice. I skipped this movie more than once because it looked like it was about big business and that just didn't interest me, but this is a thrilling spy movie. Our hero has to navigate the halls of power and dodge killers that are trying to keep him from succeeding. When the action hits, it's fast, it's intense, and the stunt work and the fight scenes that happened were so good, they just kept my blood racing. Even though this movie isn't about government organizations or shadowy terrorist groups, it has a great international espionage feel to it. There are a number of different languages being spoken here, and we get to go to a lot of exotic locales. Now, even though this story it seems to be very broad, and it even has flashbacks to let us understand how Largo came about, you never lose your interest in the story, it just deepens. Tom Sisley is great as the oddly named title character. He works as a guy living in the slums of South Africa to the dashing playboy dealing with the rich and powerful. Now Largo is a renaissance man. He's a martial artist. He's a guy who uses guns. He's all of these things, but it's the actor that makes him a great action hero. I really got caught up in the mystery of who killed the father. They made it so layered with so many false leads and some pretty suspenseful scenes that I quit trying to solve it. Now, if you're one of those really smart people that figures these things out pretty quickly, don't worry about it. This movie will not be ruined for you. It's thrilling, it's exciting, and you'll keep wanting to watch it. The heir apparent Largo Winch may have a pretty strange title, but when it comes to delivering action and the thrills, this film is spot on. Based on a comic book with a sequel yet to hit the stream, this is a character I want to see more movies from. So when you're ready for a spy movie that's not about saving the world, but more about personal revenge, then this one is definitely worth watching.